the easiest sub goal ever in Twitch. We're gonna go to your Twitch, click on Creator Dashboard. Then we're gonna go over here to our Stream Manager. And then if you don't have it set as a quick action, it's really easy to do. But you're gonna find where it says Manage Your Goals. Okay, so you have a couple options in the Twitch native goals. And I think you should, as much as you can, use any platform's native instruments and tools that they give you because I think you'll be rewarded for those. That's just an opinion. I don't know if it's true or not. So when you go to your subscription goal, you have some different options. You have total subs, you have total sub points. What that means is uh, if people sub at a tier two or three, I mean, then you get more points for that. Um, new subs or new sub points. So when I'm talking about a session or just the one stream that you're doing, that's a new sub. So I would do that. And then you would create your goal. And Twitch is so nice that they will tell you that based on your size as a creator, we recommend a goal of 10 new subscribers. And here is where you could put a description. We'll call this a Merkin upgrade. And then you have the option to customize. Look how easy, they just made it so easy for us. So you can kind of get close to your brand colors and you can either go light mode or dark mode. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it light. And then you would just save it, okay? So because there are no, no subs, it's all the way down at white. It goes white and as subs are added, it gets pink. And then all you need to do is you come down here, you see where it says browser source? You're just gonna click on that and that copies it. So here's my OBS. What we're gonna do is come down here to this plus where it says sources, add a browser source. And we're gonna create a new one and we're gonna call it Merkin Goal. Boom, we click OK, and this is where you paste the source that we just copied from that other page. Put it in there. This is the wrong height and width, width and height. It's a little girthy, so let's just change it a little bit. Okay, so here's how it looks. Okay, and it's a little bit stubby and fat, so we would just click on it, and we would change the height. You get the idea. You get the picture, right?